Hi, this is Bob Morris from ARM. I'm here at Mobile World Congress at Qualcomm's booth, and I'd like to uh, introduce you to Mark Frankel, who's going to show you a, a new cool product. Thanks, Bob. This is the Sanagi uh, Windows Mobile 6.1 product from Toshiba that Toshiba announced just uh, about two weeks ago. Uh, there are three model, uh, three units of Sanagi that we're demonstrating. This one is running in the automatic mode, an advanced uh, 3D graphics game, and you can see there's lighting and shading, um, translucency throughout the game, and this is just running in demonstration mode. And these are uh, two more Sanagi units. This one has the Toshiba user interface that uh, I can scroll through through its touch screen and get to different uh, icons on the desktop. And this one is running a advanced 3D graphics UI concept that Qualcomm um, commissioned. And just to show with an advanced graphics capability in a device what kind of rich user interfaces you can have. So here I have a spinning world. And for instance, the media icon happens to be this plant, which if I zoom in, zoom in to it, has all of the multimedia as different flowers of the, of the tree, if you will. And then if uh, the little arrow icon here means that this is a video as opposed to a still picture. So if I want to play that video, I'll click on it and it will open up in a 3D effect, and this is running an H.264 uh, um, clip. So it shows you what kind of advanced products you can make with Qualcomm's Snapdragon device. Uh, this is an extremely light smartphone based on Windows Mobile 6.1. This uh, Sanagi product is under 10 millimeters thick, so it's very thin very light, but yet has very advanced, powerful multimedia capabilities to it. Well, that, that's just fantastic, Mark. Thank you. What we're showing here is the uh, Wistron Cursebook, which is uh, a Linux-based netbook that's designed around Qualcomm's 8K Snapdragon device. And there's several unique things about this product. First of all, I know you can't tell this via camera, but it's extremely light. I can hold it up with just a few fingertips. It's very thin for a purse book, uh, for a netbook, very, very portable. So here we're surfing the net via uh, 3G coverage um, across the, the Mobile World Congresses hall. So it's got pretty good response time, even though the uh, networks are fairly loaded here at Barcelona. And um, this is probably one of the, the first 3G Linux surfing the internet web 2.0 ex experiences, uh, certainly on uh, Qualcomm's advanced 8K Snapdragon devices.